start thing with selfie cameras. Great because S21 FE can shoot 4K 60 FPS, which I'm shooting now. We got 4K 30 FPS on a 54. And I can see the difference in stabilization. Uh, S21 FE is way more stable in my opinion. However, I prefer colors on a 54. But let's take some selfies now. Okay, let's check on stabilization and quality. Both can shoot 4K, 30 FPS. I can see slightly different in colors. Uh, I think S21 FE is a little bit more natural. I think there's a bit too much saturation on A54 here. Not bad at all. Let's move on to main sensor. I am keeping both phones on a small tripod. There's no gimbal, uh, but I can clearly see that A54 is struggling a little bit. Let's move on two times. Two on A54, and then we've got times three optical lens on uh, S21 FE. I have to say, the A54 is doing an amazing job comparing with this optical times three zoom on S21 FE. So this is the quality. Again, both shooting 4K. But what's great that many people don't really know, they can switch between the lenses during recording, even switch to selfie, which is brilliant. Let's check on dynamic range. I have to say, I really like the A54. I mean, look at that. The skin tones way better. By the way, if you are enjoying this video, smash the like, I would really appreciate. Also, consider subscribing because I am buying all the phones for my own money, and this is no exception. So the bigger channel it is, so hopefully some company is gonna reach out to me and I don't have to buy all the funds for my own money. Cheers. Right, so this is the steady mode, 1080p on both. Let me do some running. Not bad at all. Now what I like on Samsung Galaxy S21 FE, you've got portrait video mode, which isn't available on A54. And also there's a dual mode video, again, not available on A54, but I'm actually using pro video mode on A54 which is also available on S21 FE. What do you think?
which one do you prefer so far? And I have to say, I am pretty impressed about the A54. I was not expecting that it's gonna be performing as well, as good as, as the S21 FE. This is, you know, a flagship device. And here we've got a mid-range phone. Uh, but let's move on to some lower light conditions at the night. Selfie camera at night, standing by the lamp. And I have to say that Bob doing a pretty good job in my opinion. What do you reckon? Older flagship device or new mid-range? Let me know in a comment below. Okay, this is a video quality at night, both 4K again. To be honest, I cannot see much of a difference, to be honest. Maybe S21 if he's slightly brighter. Uh, now, main sensor. And that's destabilization. Times two on A54. And then we got this optical zoom times three on S21 FE. Uh, but I'm going to take some pictures now. I mean, you can clearly see how much longer the S21 FE takes pictures, up to 12, 13 seconds. But on A54, it's probably about two, three seconds. What do you think? Which one is actually better at night? That's it for today. Hope you enjoyed this episode. What do you think? Which one is actually better? I don't see a clear winner here. You know, I like the uh, optical zoom on S21 FE. I like the stabilization better on S21 FE. However, dynamic range, in my opinion, is better on A54. I also prefer some of the night photography pictures. They are a little bit more natural. They're not as bright, but they're more natural. And I like more natural stuff. What do you think? For the price, I think A54 is the deal breaker. Expandable storage, better battery. Yes, the chipset not as powerful as the Snapdragon 888, uh, but I actually looked on Amazon, 319 A54. Amazing price. Let me know which one you're picking and I'll catch you in the next one. Cheers.